My name is Mary Claire McLaughlin. I'm a mechanical engineer too on the augmented reality team and I've been at Newport News Shipbuilding for four years. There are many things I enjoy about being a shipbuilder. I enjoy working with a new cutting edge technology. I enjoy learning from the craftsmen who have been doing this job for 10, 20, 40 years sometimes. Um, I enjoy showing them this new technology and showing them a new way of doing things. Augmented reality um, is a new cutting edge technology. It is similar to virtual reality, but instead of being completely immersed in a virtual environment, you are placing digital information into the physical environment. So the user is kept in their physical environment, in this case in the compartment they're on on the ship. Um, they can see the, the bulkheads, they can see the equipment, but we are placing digital information in their environment for their use. One of the major challenges we face is trying to implement a new technology in a company that has built ships the same way for decades. So it's asking these craftsmen to take an iPad and give us their drawing and trust that the application that we've built for them is going to help them do their job in a more efficient way. Taking a new technology to a person and convincing them to change the way they do their job is a really tough thing to do. But people like Mary Claire can do a great job at advancing the technology uh, here at Newport News Shipbuilding. What I do is important for our country because I'm helping to build the ships of the U.S. Navy. And I'm creating tools that are making those ships more affordable for the defense of our nation and not only during the construction of these ships, but also throughout their entire life cycle. You have to be tough to do my job because we are creating innovative solutions using a technology that most of the world has never even seen before, especially shipbuilders. Last year, we traveled to Munich, Germany and attended the International Symposium of Augmented Reality, and I presented the work that we are doing at Huntington Ingalls to a room full of industry leaders. And these guys were blown away by what we showed them. I think that it's gonna change the way we do everything eventually. Mm -hmm.